Zen by Zen3001. The last map at the moment is map 5. Um, as far as I can tell, this is the first map that's been given a... I was gonna say custom MIDI, but no, it isn't. This is the normal music. One sixty-six twenty-eight and four. Yeah, overall, Zen. Zen has a fairly decent handle on how to use hit scanners, it seems like, because they always are kind of in numbers and they're they're usually not set up in a way that they're gonna shoot each other too much. Sometimes that can happen with hit scanners, they're arranged in a way that they easily kill each other. That looks like a secret. What is it? Clearly is a secret. Maybe it's a trap for when I get the red key. I don't know, man. Wow. Well, that looks painful. Maybe I'll deal with that later. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll deal with it now. Quite a bit of detail down here with the lighting and the... It's kind of cool using the, uh... The, uh, whatever, comp span. For this purpose. Yeah, I like the detail. Alright, so I guess that probably lowers the red key for me then. Yeah, I mean, this is kind of cliche, the classic underwater map. Huh. Well, how do I get in there? I mean, even the map tells me there's something to it. Ah. I'm not sure I would have found that. The map gave it away. The auto map gave it away. Because this wasn't marked as secret. And the other side isn't either. I like that. That's very doomy thing to do. You get a glimpse of the exit and then, nope, it went away, sorry. Uh-oh. like a place for a secret. Guess I gotta go up and around, huh? I actually do. Mm. 
Yeah, this room's pretty boring, just gray and blue pretty much the whole way, rectangles. Combat in there's not bad, but... I got a secret for that. It's very Doom 1-y. That might have been from the Switch, I don't know. There's some pretty cool secrets in this wad. Not necessarily the way they're set up. They've been pretty easy. I've come away with 100 or close to 100% on every map. But what they give you is often, you know, more map rather than just closet of goodies or something. where I was before. Yeah, it's a good idea out here. There's just still not enough urgency. You know, these monsters coming at me, they're coming too slow, they're not powerful enough, and I can still retreat back, so... There's no real threat there. As soon as I get into trouble, I can run. And all I really have to do is get rid of the hit scanners, and then I got all this area to run around, so... Unfortunately, I'm not going to get all the secrets this time. That's the exit right there, isn't it? Oh wait, no it's not. Oh, 166, okay. I was going to say, there's always a secret within a secret, so... Alright. Cool little detour. Ah, now I'm on the other side. Missed an enemy and an item somewhere. That's okay. So yeah, these maps are all pretty short, pretty easy. Um, I like some of the ideas with the secrets, you know, they're kind of just more rooms, more areas to check out. So that's kind of fun. Kind of a cool, some cool concepts in here where for one you see the exit but then it kind of caves in on you so you gotta find another way, you gotta go all the way around and get the keys. Um, I like how at one point there's a big window and then you're actually out there later on in the map um, again the combat we're, we're not using any huge monsters any beefy monsters so it's staying away from being grindy and tedious you know it's not like I'm shotgunning barons or double shotgunning hordes and hordes of hell knights in huge spaces or anything like that so it's not grindy at this point but it's also just usually not all that effective it's it's you know it's it's easy it's it's simple you get you get tons of shells you get enough bullets so you can just super shack on your way through the whole level without much trouble but you know it's rewarding to place your shots well and try to avoid getting shot cuz i mean it's a bunch of hit scanners and a lot of roaming hit scanners so there are areas where you got to you got to have to you kind of have to make sure that your health is still high-ish and that you're not taking extra damage from all the little pot shots and everything so yeah overall you know still fairly simplistic here but um, 
but at the end of the day, it's somewhat enjoyable doom.